this is the dough it has risen so i'm going to knock it down So I'm going to roll it now so that I can use the cutter. This is the cutter I want to use. This is a meat pie cutter that I want to use. So I'm going to roll it. So I'll use my cutter to cut it. This is donut cutter. It's available in the market. So I'll cut it this way. So I'll leave it on the work table to rise. I finished cutting with the cutter. These are my donuts. So I want to use my hand now. This is a free hand for people that doesn't have a cutter. So I'm going to need it. I really like bread buns. I need it this way. Then I'll need it this way. Then I'll press it down. For people that doesn't have a cutter, you do not cutter. 
So I'm going to use the cover of water bottle or any drink, the cotton, put it in a floor, bring it out, then press it at the center. When you press it at the center, this is my donuts now. This is my donut. So you can leave it like this to rise. The size is according to your taste, according to what you want. For my own, I want it to be flat like this, but it's going to rise. So I don't want it to be as big as this. So this is only for people that does not have a cutter. As you can see, this, this one will rise. It's going to rise. I've just finished cutting now. So I will leave it for 30 minutes or 35 minutes for it to rise. So I want to fry my donuts now. Fry on the medium heat. Don't overcrowd the pan. So I'm removing it now. I'm removing the last batch, the last batch of my donut. I, as you can see, it's very delicious. I wish you, you can taste it, but it's not possible. Just do your own. Don't bring long that truth. Yeah, it's very delicious.
so this is my donut so delicious this so i want to break one now as you can see the one i just removed from fire this one is very hot so this is the one that i removed for the past five minutes here so i want to break it now as you can see this is how it is it's yummy yummy so please subscribe to my channel it's a new channel support me